So it's now the next day. I forgot to do an ending to that video yesterday. So I thought I'd just sum up my experience of pushing myself outside. Obviously it's very cold weather at the moment. Um, it was quite windy yesterday as well. Um, on my other chair, which I was pushing myself in, not the one I have upstairs here. Um, on that chair, my rubber coating for my push rooms has come off. I kind of hit the child on the floor. Stand up. Just stand up. So yeah, the push room coating has come off. It was kind of all flapping off, so I cut most of it off, um, which means there isn't as much grip on there as there used to be. To get these replaced will cost me probably a couple of hundred pounds, so I'm not bothering doing that, because my chair is so old. It's, I've had it for nine years now, and it definitely needs replacing. I also have an electric wheelchair, as you've seen in many of my videos before. Um, I normally would use this when we're out and about, like at the beach um, there, although I can't go on the sand in my electric wheelchair. But just for kind of going along the promenade bit there, I'd normally be in my electric wheelchair because it means I can be more independent, not have to get Tom to push me um, all the time. And it just gives me a bit more freedom. And it means I can kind of have Rafe on my lap if I need to. Um, I can hold things and move rather than... So it means I can hold things on my lap. And this is a great video, isn't it? Just Emily eating in the background. <laughs> so that was what I wanted to say at the end of this video. Um, generally, in my manual chair, when I'm out and about on that kind of like um, outdoor surface, I would get somebody to push me because it's um, easier, it takes less time. I don't get so tired and worn out. My hands don't get so kind of, they kind of go all like hard and dry. Um, from pushing, especially in the cold weather. So, and it's really hard, if there's any kind of gradient at all, then it's really difficult and I can't like maintain um, the rhythm and the speed above like half a mile an hour. So yeah, that was okay because it was flat. That and kind of supermarket floor um, smoothness is all I can manage really. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, I'll be back later on this week with another exercise video probably in here, probably with Emily joining me as well. So yep, please give it a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.